ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ್ವ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವೈಶ್ಯಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದು ವ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವುನಿ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶ ನೀಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದರುಣ ಧ್ಯೇಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತ್ತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತುಪಾಲಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಷು ಆದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗ್ರಸಾಗ್ರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಕ್ಯಕಾಶ್ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶಿವಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶಿವಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾಬದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಕ್ಷ ಭೀಷಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಯುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿವ್ಯರೂಪ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿ ತಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷು ಬದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಶ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಜಸ್ತೆ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಭಿ ತ್ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
जत्तोत्तम श्लोक गुणानुवाद प्रस्तूयते ग्रम कथा विघाता निषद्यम मनोदीन मुमुक्षुर्मती सती यछति वासुदेव जत्तोत्तम श्लोक गुणानुवाद प्रस्तूयते ग्रम कथा विघाता निषभ्यम मनोदीन मुमुक्षुर्मती सती यछति वासुदेव गौड़ीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर भोपाल परमंश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट दोज वर डेमोनिक कैरेक्टर दोज वर कपाट दे कैन नॉट स्टे फॉर लॉन्ग टाइम इन साइड अविद्याहरण नाट्य मंदिर गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर भोपा परमंश जगत गुरु टोल्ड those who are kapat people demonic character they cannot stay inside avidharan natya mandir for long time in the guise of devotees they can stay there for some time in the guise of devotees but after some time their naked picture become exposed like agasur bakasur they wanted to prove their friendly very nice friendly relationship with bhagwan putana wanted to prove that i am like mother they wanted to prove that i we have friendly relationship with krishna but ultimately it was proved not to it is totally false similar way those who are against gauriya devotees gauriya guru varga those who are kapat those who are demonic character they are trying their best to stay inside avidavara natya mandir but they cannot stay there for long immediately they feel excited they feel problem and they go outside avidharan natya mandir mean where you are going to cut your avidha surely why prabhupad wanted to keep the name of natya mandir avidharan because prabhupad was sure about it that those who are coming in avidhara natya mandir from heart surely they can cut avidha no problem popat was sure about it pure guru vishnu of they can put guarantee they sure about it otherwise any other common people cannot keep the name of avidha one natya mandir avidhara natya mandir he cannot feel that kind of spirit because you know we are kapat avidharan natya mandir shri chaitanya mahat avidharan natya mandir anybody coming from heart to get to get help from guru vaishnav to protect anybody come to protect himself from maya immediately he can do it it was proved is called avidhara natya mandir at present there is no such guarantee at present there is no such guarantee because we are less interested to maintain all the idealism of the prabhupad we are less interested we cannot do it that's why there is no such guarantee we cannot give such guarantee Baba speaking we are inviting garbage from outside into our natya mandir whereas it was a target of bhakti vinod takur to sweep outside sweep away outside all garbage but we are inviting 
like in the golden shop you have seen, golden shop, they are sweeping inside. You don't know. Those were golden shop here in India, outside I don't know. They are, sweep, they are sweeping inside. Because some golden particle, gold particle can be there. So, they are selling the dust. Sometimes people coming from outside, they are buying the dust. And from the, yes, it depends upon how many, uh, I mean, how much, uh, you know, your gold, gold ornament you are making. It depends upon that, the valuation of the dust. There is a condition. So this way, all around, you can find some problem all around. I was discussing yesterday, Sadhu Sangha is inevitable. Sadhu Sangha, without any fail, you can get result, provided your Sadhu Sangha is perfect Sadhu Sangha, you have no duplicity, Sadhu Sangha can get result, 100%. You can remember, Prahlad Maharaj was not initiated by anybody. Prahlad Maharaj was not initiated directly by anybody, but Prahlad Maharaj got initiation indirectly by hearing all Bhagavad Katha from Naraji Maharaj, that also while he was inside womb. While he was inside womb, then he heard all Bhagavad Katha, Hari Katha from Naraji Maharaj. That was the reason for why he got Bhakti. That was the reason for why. Usually it is written in Shastra, you will have to, first of all, you can, first of all, you can realize about your instability. A thought of Brahma Jigasa can develop inside your heart. What I can do? Where I can go? After that, who can protect me? Money cannot protect me. How I can be protected? Then you can search one Sadguru. Then you can take shelter onto the Sadguru. Sadguru can give you shelter. You can get mantra. After that you can go on chanting mantra, following all Bidhi Marg. All Bidhi Marg you can. Bidhi Marg, well, all system you have to follow. And if your luck is very good, if your luck is very good, why I speak so? Because maybe your luck is not good. You cannot develop love for Guru Vaishnava. You can find fault. That's why I said those if you are lucky. If you are lucky enough, then under the guidance of Guru Vaishnava today or tomorrow, in course of following your Bidhi mark in total, in total, you are not going to waste your time, nothing. Whatever instruction you are going to get from your Gurudev, you are going to follow it. Then gradually, gradually someday, you can develop some loveful affair with Bhagavan. I mean, from Bidhi Mark, you can step into Ragmar, which is not at all easy. Which is not at all so easy. Ragmal. Ragmal means spontaneous, spontaneous attraction you can feel for Bhagavan. Guru Vaishnav, for Guru Vaishnav Bhagavan, you can feel some spontaneous attraction, not artificial. In that case, you can step into Raganuga Bhajan, all your seva mood, gradually can get some freedom to satisfy Bhagavan. Try to understand what he say. First of all, when you are starting Vidhima, there is some restriction. If you are not going to follow, you can fall down. But after that, someday you can develop some such a mood that you can feel free to serve Bhagavan. It's very nice mood, which is called spontaneous loveful relationship with Bhagavan. That you can develop someday if your luck 
is good, then you can develop. Otherwise, it's a big, big problem. You cannot... Kaivalla nara kāyate, tidasa pūra akāsa puspāyate, duddhan tendriya indra indriya padri sapatkātu zangstāyate, vidip mahindadhishya kitāyate, visham purna sukhāyate, jat korona kataksha vaibhavatam tam gaura me vasnanu. Kaivalla nara kāyate, tidasa pūra akāsa puspāyate, duddhan tendriya kāla sarpa patali pratkātu zangstāyate, Vidit mahindadhishya kitayate, visham purna sukhayate, yat karuna kataksha vaibhavatam, tam gaura mevas tumho. Our Guru Bhargava Pavadana Sarasva was speaking, I am going to pray unto the lotus feet of that God, ocean of infinity mercy, infinity, ocean of infinity mercy. If you are going to get the smell, ah, smell of Gaurcharan, not Gaur, only the smell of Gaurcharan, then it is more than sufficient. Even one dog going to get the smell of Gaurcharan, he can go. We identify ourselves as human being, but one dog, is going to get some smell of Gauranga, can go. Such excellent thing. So, Kaivala Narakayati. If somebody asking me, you like to get Kaivala Mukti? Kaivala mean? Kaivala mean? No, no problem can touch me anymore. I mean, I like to go out of the influence of Satarajatama mood of Maya. Kaivala. In that case, I cannot feel any pain, nothing. Kaivalla narakayate, tidasa pura akasa puspayate. Tidasa pura akasa puspayate, tidasa pura. Even you are given heavenly planet or upper planet, tidasa pura, sarga matupada, tidasa pura akasa puspayate. You think, hey, you think that Indra Maharaj is very happy. It is your conception. That's why you like to go there in heaven. But not so. Indra Maharaj is not happy. We think so. Indra Maharaj is very happy. Maybe he is the king of heaven, having big power, having the controlling in heaven. All, demoti, all demigods going to obey him. So surely he is happy. But not so. It is written in Shastra. It is written in Shastra, Indra is not happy. His intention. I already told the network developed by Indra. So he is going to be involved in this network. It's caught. So do you think inside network you can feel happy? It is written. Nacha Indra Sashukham Kinchin Nasukham Chakravartinaha Shukham Asti Virakta Samunir Ekanta Jivina. You think Indra is very happy, but it is written in Shastra. No happiness in Indra, in the feeling tension. Whenever demon can attack, oh my, I must get ready. Or already demon is going to invade, and then what to do? I cannot fight, no arrangement, then flying away. Going away from heaven, leaving wife, even have no controlling over wife. Wife there, yes, husband gone, Indra. Sachidevi there, in the heaven, helpless, but her husband gone. The so have you seen? So it is written, Nacha Indrasya Sukham, Kinchinna Sukham Chakravarti Naha. One Chakravarti, Raj Chakravarti, who is enjoying full sovereignty, he is also not happy. So many historical evidence, you know, so many evidence from different Purana, we can give you. Who was happy? No one, nobody was happy. All day we saw they were in problem. Who saw? Nuhus, Goyo. Who? Dilip Raja, who? Who was happy? You show me? All the tension, big problem. 
then no happiness. So nocha indra sasukam kinchin nasukam chakravarti naha. But transcendental happiness is there with one great devotees of Bhagavan. They are very happy all the time. That's why they are always in Sankirtan mood. Why they are in Sankirtan mood? Like Chaitanya Mahapu on his devotee. Any time. Any time is Sankirtan time. Not that, oh, four o'clock after, not now, five o'clock. Not any time. There is no restriction. Any time, 10 o'clock, 9, 11 o'clock, Mahaprabhu crying and Advaita Gosai, you know, as, as you know, there, uh, Rai Ramananda speaking Katha and Sarupadama speaking Katha. No restriction of time. It is not a time bound program that we can do Sankirtan for two hours. No, it was too much hot. <laughs> not that. <laughs> they are not foolish like us. They are not foolish. In their life, it is not a time bound program. We have seen in the life of Spanabha Sridhar Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Bhavan, there are no time, any time people come in speaking Harikatha. Any time come in speaking Harikatha. It is not a time bound program. So those sadhus, they are happy. Why? They are namasraya. They have taken shelter of that Nam Prabhu. And always they are speaking about Nam Nam, Rup Nam, Gun Nam, Lila Nam, Parikar Nam, Vaishishto Nam, all Nam, Dham Nam, all Dham, all related with one single Tata. All Dham, Nam, Rup, Lila. All devotees, all one tata, one single tata. You think different. You have some divisive attitude, but not that. Single tata. So all the time they are happy, transcendental happiness prevailing inside the heart all the time. Be it night, day, midnight, morning, all the time. Follow. So we see, even King of heaven in the Maharaj is not happy. He is in problem all the time. In problem. Too much headache. And we gone through Gopakumar, his activities. When he was Gopakumar was given the kingship or the controlling override, it was not suitable for him. Because Niskin Janmak. He was given so much facility. Well, you can sit in the king in the chair is sitting, but he was not feeling happy. Because his mood is totally different. He was Niskinchan, Bhajavasi. How you can feel? All king, all, you know, guard man here, there. What is this? What is this? They don't like. What? They useless. Pure Guru Vaishnava, always they are in Sankirtan mood. If they are fine, suitable devotees all around, they can do. Otherwise, alone they are doing Sankirtan all the time. Thinking, thinking, so many things they are doing. All the time, association going on. So, only one pure devotee, he is really happy. He is always happy, all the time. So, Kaivala Narakayate, Tidasa Pura Akasa Puspayate, Sargamatta Patal, any, you know, sovereignty over oh, full art, full heaven, sarga patal, there, down, all you can be given power to maintain, oh, they cannot take. They cannot take. They cannot take. Prahlad Maharaj didn't want to take, no, Prabhu, you are okay, no. No, you will have to take. Because if you take charge of this kingdom, you are devotee. Why Bhagavan usually, why usually Bhagavan requesting Pallad Mara, Dhuva Mara, why? You have to sit. No, we don't. no, you have to sit. Why? Because Bhagavan knows it very well. They are devotee. If they are going to sit in the chair, then automatically they will be influenced. They influence, influence their personality. Then all other in the country, they can also feel it necessary to do Hari Bhajan. Otherwise, if demon sitting, 
Like Hiranubhu, hey, stop worshipping Bhagavan. I am Bhagavan, you worship me. You can see. Hiranubhu goes, whom you are worshipping? Like Ben Raja. His father was so pious man. But he lived Angaraj. He ultimately was very fed up and gone to forest, leaving that boy. Oh, the useless. Finally, when he was given the controlling power, he is going to exhibit demonic character. Ah, whom you are worshipping? Wasting time? Rishi Muni, he is chiding him. Ah, stop! Whom Jagga, whatever. Well, you, king is the all in all. King is Bhagavan. Then all Muni Rishi wanted to give some judgment, you know. This is not good. Your father was very pious and we know Bhagavan is there. We are, we are worshipping him. But he, he become more and more angry. Then Rishi Muni, what do? What they are doing? They become very angry and they curse him. Oh, you die. You burn up immediately. Rishi Muni become angry. They curse and they burn up. There is a condition. So, pure devotees, they are less interested. Kaivalla narakayate, tidasa pur, akasha puspayate, duddhantendriya kalo sarpapatil patkhato dhangshayate, all sense organ, they are all like poison or snack. All your sense organs, they are all like poison or snack. Anytime they bite you, and you can feel pain. Follow. You cannot satisfy your sense organ. Not possible. Never you can. They can never get satisfaction. Because satisfaction is not there. No. Endless. Your desire, your hope, your enjoying mood, all can tends to infinity. You can never get happiness. Hundred percent. It is proved in Shastra. It is proved in Shastra that your enjoying mood, your desire, your annavilas can give, can can be extended up to infinity. It can go, but still you cannot get happiness. Because happiness is not there. Happiness is not there. You like to search like a blind happiness there. The more you can enjoy, the more you will put yourself in trouble. Because in the fire, in the fire, if you are going to put ghee, if you are going to put ghee in the fire, so can you expect the fire to extinguish? A fire can never get extinguished. Fire can never get extinguished. Because you are going to... How possible? But people trying their best. This way, they are in confusion. In infinity period at the time of death, there is no satisfaction. Old man, 90 years age, but still karma is there. He likes to enjoy, but cannot do. Because he's old. He likes to chew chicken, but cannot do. Because due to old age. But desire is there. Not that old man is free from desire. No. Even young batch, somehow they can realize something, they can come in line. But old man, those who are mature, they already, whatever they realize, that realize. They are newly, they cannot run. If you, so it seems they are now old man, very matured, very nice. Not that. Sometimes they are so great, so big beast. Old man, sometimes they are so big beast that you cannot imagine inside heart. Externally they are tranquil of everything. Inside desire is there. There is no satisfaction. No satisfaction. So if you are going to add fuel, fuel in the fire, you can never expect that the fire can get extinguished. This is the condition. So, Pavadana Sarasiva speaking, Koivalla narakayata tidasa pyura akasa vispayate 
Duddhantendriya Kalo Sarpa Patrali Prakhato then Shayati. Like one snack, like one poisonous snack, one poisonous snack, but if you, if one expert going to catch the poisonous snack and open the mouth, open the mouth and with one holder, you know, going to break the poison tea. If poison teeth gone, you can play, you can sleep with the snack. <laughs> what you can do? Yes. If the poison is gone, then with snack you can in the bed, you can sleep. No problem. What you can do? <laughs> snack cannot cut. Main problem is poison. So that Pavadana Sarasabha speaking, those who are having great love, devotion unto the lotus feet of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, Automatically, all his poisonous snack like all you know sense organ is just like poisonous teeth already eradicated, cut, thrown outside. So, all your sense organs there as it is, but not no problem. You can play with them, you can do a seva bhagavan. Pratkata Sanstayate, Bidhi Mahindad Dishya Kitayate. Bidhi, if, if somebody is going to give you the post of Brahma or Indra, no interest. You can take. It's too much headache, Brahma. Forehead cannot control. Forehead there, but we are always in problem. Bidhi Mahindad Dishya Kitayate. If somebody is going to give you the post, if, if Bhagavan also is going to, I can give you the post of Brahma, you can take? No. I can give you the post of Indra. No. It is like insect. Bhagavan Sarasvati Ghi, if the, the offer, the offer of the, the offer given to you to sit in the, in the chair of Brahma, it is like insect. Which insect? Huh. You can throw like insect. Vidhi mahindad dishya kitayati. And visham purna sukhayati. Because one paramangsa devotee always feeling happiness all around. Though we know, if you go through newspaper, if you go through different channels, you can find the whole world is burning. Whole wall burning. Whole wall. Whole wall. Wherever you can. You go anywhere. Australia, Russia, anywhere you go, all burning. India, everywhere, all burning. Nowhere you can. Canada, everywhere, all burning. Fire. England, nowhere happiness. But you are searching happiness. There. What is not there? What is not where? What is not where? It is your desire to get that thing from there. That is your mistake. Foolish people. Or it is not available here. Ah, you give me bhakti, or bhakti is not there, how can you? Decoration of bhakti is there. But you are, no, Maharaj, give me that. How can you? Bhakti is not there, no. Nothing there, only decoration, external decoration, new market, decorated new market by Mayadevi, all around, new, new items, everything, lucrative offer, but Bhakti is not there. Whole world burning, but one pure devotee, always feeling the whole world is a place like Vaikuntha. Because the fire, Growing there, not going to touch their heart. They are, maintain, they are maintaining their exclusive existence. I mean, they are eternally present in Golokdhan. Their body is there, but they are not feeling any problem. They are not feeling any problem. Visham Purana Sukhayate Jat Koruna Kataksha Vaivavatam Tam Gaura We are going to do stava of that Gauranga by the help of which I can feel useless all the posts of Brahma, Indra, the insect. 
by the help of Gauranga, I can feel all my sense organs. They are, they are, they are like snack, but they are all poisonous teeth are eradicated. No problem. If I am giving the controlling over Sarga Matta Patal, heaven, hell, and still you cannot feel any interest. That is called the mood of devotee. That is called the mood of devotee. So, what I was speaking, that in gradual course, by following Vidimark today or tomorrow, you can go ahead. You can go ahead and get bhakti. But deep, deep relationship, I mean loveful relationship, that is only available by the association of pure devotees. I mean those who are, is only possible. Without getting such association, nobody, never can get this kind of bhakti. Bhagavan Sri Krishna speaking to Dha. Yesterday, I already told, when Bhagavan wanted to speak this way, wanted to indicate, satsanga labdhaya bhakta mai mangsa apasita shavai me darshitam sadvir ranjasa bindati padam. By the guidance, by the kripa of my pure devotees, very easily somebody can get bhakti, which is really rare. But satsanga labdhaya bhakta mahi mamsa upasita upasita shavai me darshitam sadhvi ranjasa bindhati padam. They can indicate how how you can get the lotus feet of Bhagavan very easily. Then Uddhav naturally was very much interested to know the symptom of devotees because Bhagavan giving so much emphasis on this subject matter. So Uddhavji Maharaj asking, Shadus tabo uttama sloka mataha kidrik vidaha prabhu How we can know what is the symptom of devotees? Bhakti stoi up, eh? Bhakti stoi upar yeta kidrishi shadbhir adritaha. How, what is the symptom of sadhu? How you ca we can get bhakti from them? And etat me purushad dhaksho, lokad dhaksho, jagat prabhu, eh? Pranatayana raktayo prapannayo cha kathatam. What speaking? First of all, speaking, Pranatayana raktayo. Pranatayana mane, I am, I am paying pranam, pranato. Pranato mane, I am already inclined to you. Pranatayo. Pranatayo mane, there is no false ego, nothing. All gone. Pranutayo, first point pranutayo, first point pranutayo, I am, I am totally inclined to you. Second, anuraktayo, I have deep attraction, I am feeling deep attraction for you. I have my deep attachment for your lotus feet. So, pranutayo, anuraktayo, pranutayo, pranutayo, mane, who is going pranam? In Gita, we are watching three, three things. Tadviddi, Panipatina, Paripasana, Sevaya. Here, Pranatayo means actually, Pranatayo means without, is going to throw all false ego, everything, and Pranatamani is going to pay Dandavat. And after that, Anuraktayo, feeling deep attraction, I am feeling for lotus feet, I have natural attraction for your lotus feet and propanayam. Propanayam mana, I submit 100%. Pranoto also mean, pranoto mean, actually the definition of pranoto, I, when somebody doing pranam, pranam mean Prabhupada speaking, who is going to throw all speak. 
all false ego. Nama, nama mean na plus ma. Nama mean nama, you know, nama, nama mean na, nama mean no, ma mean false ego. So first line you can see uh, pranotayo, pranotayo, okay, no false ego, okay. Second, I have natural attraction for Lord. I am anuraktayo. A proper name and hundred percent inclined. Okay, proper. Kathatam, please you, please you speak out kindly. Please you speak out fine, and so that I can realize something. Previously, I forgot to speak you. Bhagavan giving advice to Uddhav. Those who are great, those who are doing bhajan to get that Brahma Vastu, imp, though Brahma is I myself, but those who are doing bhajan to get that Brahma Vastu, there is no surety. Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, Uddhav it is more practical. If somebody is going to concentrate unto my Satchidananda Sarup, Bhagavan speaking to Uddhav, Uddhav, it is more practical if somebody is going to concentrate unto the lotus feet of my Satchidananda Sarup. Somebody is not going to do bhajan of my Satchidananda Sarup, they are busy with Chit Brahma, Chin Matra Anubhati, Brahma Vastu. Bhagavan speaking, there is no guarantee. There is every possibility of hold down. Because there is no, they cannot get any attraction now. Nah. They cannot feel any attraction there. Because Bhagavan already told in Gita, Abhyaktohi gatir duksham deho vadbhi rabapate. It is very difficult to concentrate in my Abhyakta Sarva. It is very difficult to concentrate your mind in abhyakta sarva, abhyakta means no abhyakta, formless brahma, abhyakta sarva, follow, formless brahma. Bhagavan speaking in Gita, it is very difficult, but if somebody is doing what I can do, abhyakta hi gatir duksham deho badbhi rabhapate. Those who are human beings, I mean those who I have there, but it is quite easy for them to consent in it, why? Saru, because if they are going to consider in my saru, naturally they can think about my qualities, about my saru, I mean how I am, what is my desire, how I am playing Leela, everything. So naturally there is possibility that they can come to me. But a Bhakta Saru, formless Brahmo, is very difficult. You cannot get stability, no. No big problem. So, Bhagavan speaking, there is every possibility for them to fall down. Those who are busy with my formless Brahma, or you know, that Brahma Jyoti, even those who are yogi concentrating in Paramatma, they are also no guarantee. Because anyway, they are not going to take advantage of Seva. Yogi going to do Seva? No, going to seek inside. Not going to serve. He is not going to accept his Bhagavan as Shep Babastu. So Bhagavan speaking, it is very sweet my devotional procedure. Very sweet my devotional procedure is more practical for those who are interested to come to me. For them is very And bhakta aham ekaya labhya. Only by the help of bhakti, uddhav, somebody can know me. Only by the help of bhakti. Because of, in Upanishad also it is written. Bhakti re naivam nyati, bhakti re naivam tarsayati. Eh? It is written in Upanishad. Bhakti is going to take us very safely. Bhakti is going to take us very safely. 
untold lotus feet of Bhagavan. Bhakti is going to show us, you see Bhagavan. Bhakti is going to help us. Bhakti re mahi, bhakti re naivam. Eh? Darshayati bhakti re naivam. You know. This is written in Upanishad. Bhakti re naivam nayati, bhakti re naivam darshayati. Bhakti, you know. They are going to glorify bhakti. So, those who are going to take shelter of bhakti is very more practical. Bhagavan, Sri Krishna, ready to give answer to Uddhavji Maharaj, Uddhavji putting, you know, praying, it is one kind of prayer. It is one kind of prayer, I already told. Uddhavji Maharaj speaking, it is actually prayer. Manin, going to request Bhagavan, I pray you, you speak me. And this way. Shadu stavattama sloka mataha kidrik vidaha prabhu bhakti stai upar yati upar yeta kidrishi shadhi radhita etatme purusha dhaksha loka dhaksha jagat prabhu pranatayano panatayano raktayo prapannayo chakathatam Speak to me. After that, Uddhavji is going to glorify Bhagavan because this is the last time Bhagavan can go away. Bhagavan cannot say. So, he is going to satisfy. Again, Uddhavji is speaking. Tam Brahma Paramam, Tam Brahma Paramam, Boma Purusham Prakatehe Paraha, Avatirno Si Bhagavan, Sechayo Pato, Prithag Bapuhu. Uddhavji is all speaking. You are Brahma. You are that para Brahma Purusho Prakate Paraha. In Vaikuntha Jagat Golok Dham, you are staying there. And you are beyond Prakriti. You are far beyond Prakriti. Prakriti cannot touch you. But you are out of your causeless mercy. It is your highness that out of your causeless mercy, you appear in the material world for our benefit. It is your highness. You have no... What business Bhagavan has with... What business you can expect Bhagavan can have with us? Any business Bhagavan can have? No. What purpose you can? To sell, help us. What we can give to Bhagavan? Like our Guru Bhargava used to say, if you go to Ganga, taking bath, if, some, if you need to worship, what you can do? You can take Ganga water and put it in Ganga. How you can worship? We are going to Ganga to take bath. Uh, Sometimes we are giving, giving flower, it has to be different. But usually when I am going to Ganga, then you will have to worship Ganga with Ganga water. You can take Ganga water. Ganga is Ganga de Boi Namaha. You can speak. So you are worshipping Ganga Devi with Ganga water. So we are worshipping with flower, fruits, garland, whatever. All Ganga. Because all Bhagavan have. You cannot all land, property, whatever, Bhagavan. Who can claim? Eh? Who can claim? Is there any king? Parikidma, Ambarisma, Swaru, who can claim this land is my land? And <laughs> no, all they gone. <laughs> they gone, banished. Nohus Raja gone, Gwai Raja, Dilip Raja, all, Puru Raba, all gone. Now it is our, you know, time. So this way everybody vanished. So what property was there? Try to remember. What property was there when the world was created? Same property at present also. Only mobilize, resource mobilization. If you are a student of economics, you can understand. Only resource mobilization can give a new form of the property. And gold was there inside. You take out and make ornament. ornament. But you are, you are not going to take bring ornament from the from you know from separate star or planets 
all whatever property was there. Man, not one. Whatever property, like we in physics read now, the theory of constant of energy. Energy can never be created. Only energy can be transformed from one energy to other. That you read? Not read? Physics? Small, small boy they can read. Energy can never be created. Only you can transform one energy from another energy. That is what I am giving mechanical energy in the waiting time. Then heat develop, water falling, we can put in a turbine and then according to Faraday's law we can make current. So this way you can do. For petrol you can combustion, in combustion chamber petrol can go, ignition, then the by pressure of the inner pressure your wheel is going on. But you think you are trying. In the whole world, not whole world, in the infinity universe. Not world, it is wrong. In infinity universe, wherever, whatever energy was there before creation and after creation, even after when the creation all can dissolve, same energy can be there, nobody can destroy, can steal nothing. But you never, you never stop thinking about this thing in your life. They really so. All whatever property, diamond or maybe from here, Kahinur diamond, British people going to steal and go there. But where is there? In this world, no. Nah. Maybe from here, they are going to England. From England, they can take it. But the property is there with Bhagavan. Somebody, some foolish people speaking. Where is Bhagavan? Eh? The dockoids coming and you know, taking away all ornament from temple, Bhagavan is there. And <laughs> they are speaking. Yes, they are speaking. Bhagavan is there. The, why not Bhagavan taking action? I say, you are idiot number one. What do you say? I am number idiot. Sorry, sorry. You are number idiot. Number one idiot. Not only idiot. You think your limited conception, limited idea, you are going to attribute in the, you are going to attribute in the case of Bhagavan. You think I am okay, five feet, Ma, maybe Bhagavan is 10 feet. This you can think. This is your conception. Always, always, always one kind of estimation going on. You are never beyond any estimation. That is the main problem. Everybody, everybody, they are busy with some estimation. Oh, maybe this, maybe this. But estimation is not allowed here. The Aprakita Vastu. So in the whole universe, infinite universe, whatever energy was there one crores of years before or after, all same. Only we can make some resource mobilization and give some different form. Gold was there inside, we can take out from mine, filter, take out, and it is sold in the market, you buy and make some ornament, that is it. But same is there. So if somebody is going to blame that in that 18 times, 18 times Somnath Mandir, Somnath in Gujarat, 18 times dockoids came, one Muslim dockoids came, 18 times. He took everything from Somnath, Somnath temple. So many property, underground, yeah, Sivji, Sivji, Jyotir Lingo, Dada's Jyotiling one. Eighteen times. They come and loot and loot and loot. So Shankar Bhagavan could easily give punishment to them. But Shankar Bhagavan busy with Bhagavan, lotus feet of Bhagavan Krishna. Who is that? Who can I take? What I can do? What is the utility? I am Jogi, staying in the forest, you know. And what I diamond is no utility. And my wife also. Her detachment is no, she is not taking anything. She is not speaking me, you arrange one ornament for me. <laughs> Shankar Bhagavan saying in Kailas, here yeah, they are all detachment. So, no utility. So if somebody is going to loot Guru Vaishnava or Bhagavan, is okay, okay, God. Like the case of our 
Bhagavan Das Babaji, Nam Brahmo, he used to worship. Apparently you can think he is a crazy man, but Paramahansa. One day Seva coming, Baba, 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 what happens? All ornaments stolen. All ornaments stolen from temple. So what we can give to Nam Brahma? Okay, maybe it is the desire of Nam Brahma that's gone. <laughs> maybe, maybe it is the desire of so gone. Okay, when he like to wear, oh, again can come, no problem. Stop, do bhajan. Some day after, some ornament coming back. Ornament again coming back. Follow. Same thing. Our Bangshidat Babaji Maharaj, somebody stolen all, uh, ornament, everything, go Nithai. Babaji Maharaj coming in the uh, Bhajan Kutira. Where is ornament? He asking to Nithyananda go. Where is ornament? Whom you have given? Whom you are given? Where gone? Who knows what kind of discussion took place between Gaur Nita and Babaji Maharaj? Mangshidat Babaji Maharaj. Babaji immediately gone to some house, very rock up and going to knock and speaking the name of the man who stolen. Talk, 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 talk. Talk, talk, talk. And speaking the name. Uh, you bring the ornament. Bhagavan, I mean, Gaur Nita, like to wear it. Give me. Not speaking, you have stolen, not speaking. Humble moon. You have taken ornament from there. Knock the door by name. You open and give the ornament. Gornita like to wear. Then the demon coming out and push Babaji Maharaj from up. Babaji Maharaj fall down from up and break the leg. So much pain. And Babaji Maharaj coming with this leg. Not going to doctor to check up. Coming very and coming to Gornita and speaking. You allow him to steal and you arrange my beating by him. What is the, your calculation? Is it good? Yes, asking. You allow that man to go uh, with Arnaman. I go there, you send me and he beat me. You arrange my beating. With okay, whatever you like. Your desire is the final. I have no comment. So this is the mood of pure Guru. If you like to test them, still today, if you have any doubt, you can test them. Take everything from them. Only with coping they can go away. If you don't believe, you write in stamp paper. You write in stamp paper. And say, this agreement. They can sign and go away. With only coping, no kamal, nothing. Because pure devotees were going, automatically everything comes. Automatically everything comes. They are not going anywhere to say, they automatically come. So, Uddhavji Maharaj speaking, Tam Brahma Paramam Brahma Purusham Prakate Paraha Avatirna Oshi Bhagavan Sechaya Pato Prithagavapu You are that super personality. Paratwara Kilishwar, you are staying in Parabham, Golok, Vrindavan and Vaikuntha, all everywhere. Tam is Brahma. Brahma no hi pratishtha aham. Bhagavan speaking in Gita. Brahma no hi pratishtha aham. What is Brahma? I myself. Jat Brahma niskala mananta masesha bhutam yad gavinna madhi purusham tam aham bhajan. It's the body fulgence of it. But people cannot see Jyotir Abhyantare. One big light, Jyoti infinity. If you cut that light, enter, then you can see, oh, Bhagavan is there. Same thing in Upanishad. Jyotir Abhyantare, this sloka, also, Hiran Mayena Patrena Sattasya Pahitam Mukham, in Upanishad. In Upanishad, one golden pot. Inside that secret property is kept. Outside only light and light, golden light, cannot find. Upanishad speaking. What do you mean? It means Bhagavan is there. Hiran Mayena Patrena Sattva Swapahitan. That's that that absolute truth is kept very secretly, tight. Very, very secret property is kept. 
the face of the pot is very sealed. Hiran maina patrena shatta shapahitam mukham. So now Bhagavan going to Uddhava and speaking this way, glorifying Bhagavan. Glorifying Uddhava, glorifying Bhagavan. And now Bhagavan speaking, Kripalu rakrita dho titikshu sarva dehinam shatta saro anavadyatma samaha sarvo upokarakaha kamai rahat dhir danto suchir midu suchir rakinchanaha Aniho mṛtabhuk shantaha stīro macharano munihi apramatto gavhīrātmā dhriti māna jito saro gūnaha amāne mānadaha kalpo maitraha kāruniqaha kavihi So many things. A one-one quality, if I go on discussing, it will take months. One-one sadhu, what quality? It needs explanation, no? How I can know? So Bhagavan speaking, Kripalu rakrita doho titikshuhu sarva dehinam Shatta saro anavadvatma samaha sarva pukarakaha Kama irahat dhir danto miduhu suchi rakin janaha Aniho mrita bhukshantaha sthira macharano muni Apramato gavhir atma dhriti mano Jita sara guna amani mana daha kalpo maitraha karuni kaha kavihi. I mean, Kripalu, ocean of mercy. Rakita draho, I am going to draw some sketch line only, no time. Kripalu, ocean of mercy. Akrita draho, never fight with anybody. Akrita draho. Titikshu, there is the reason for why you should be angry, but you are not angry. There is so many, there is sufficient reason for why the sadhu become, should be angry, but not angry. It is called Titikshu. So, Kripalu Akrita Do Titikshu Sarvadehinam. For any Jivatma, they are not going to fight with anybody. No complain, nothing. They are not going to police station to find one case. <laughs> Those who are Paramahansa, you know. Sarva Dehinam for personal interest. Shattasar. They are going to grasp their absolute truth tightly. You know? You don't know. They are going to grasp that absolute truth tightly. I cannot leave your lotus feet. Shashattasaro Anavadda Atma. Shattasaro means they are always they are always living for that absolute truth. They are always living for that absolute truth. They are not living for any Maya. Shattasar. I mean they are in favor of absolute truth all the time. Anavadma Atma unparalleled, unbeaten. Anyhow, they cannot be defeated. I mean, material qualities cannot defeat them. It's Anavad Mahatma. Samaha, equal sight for everybody. Equal sight for everybody. Not up and down. Politics or partiality, nothing there. So, Samaha, Sarbo Pukarakaha. They are always believed they are always busy to seek the benefit, absolute benefit for all Jivatma. Sarbo Pukarakaha. For all Jivatma, any Jivatma, any mosquito, for them also. How they can. So, Sarbo Pukarakaha. Always they are seeking the opportunity to how, how to help them to get Bhakti. To, uh, to take them to Bhagavan. Sarbo Pukaraka. Kamai Rahato Dhir. Then they are untouched by any karma. They are untouched by any karma. 
no karma can touch them. They are untouched by any karma, so no karma can touch them. So, kamai rahato dhir dhir danto. Dhir means intellect, stable intellect. Nishyatya ka buddhi, dhir. Danto. Danto means external sense organ. Shanto, danto, danto. All sense organ under control. Dhir, danto, mridu, very soft quality. Very soft. Those who are keeping the lotus feet confined inside the heart of them, they naturally they are very soft. So they are very soft. Mriduhu suchi kamai rahato danto mriduhu, very soft quality and suchi, very pure. Purity regarding external purity and internal purity, both you will have to consider. After that, when you can reach that stage, after that, when you can reach up to that stage, when external purity is not so important. But that stage you will have to go. But before that, it is more practical to uh, maintain internal purity and external purity, both. External purity, they never hate anybody. They know they, they cannot maintain so strict regulation that's why they never hate anybody. They love. But they know it is not possible. They are going market here, there. How? They are not possible for them. That's why they are. So, Suchir Akinchanaha. Suchi means purity. But in this context, I should say that purity means to remember Bhagavan. It is a. It is a highest concept it is the highest conception of purity when you are able successful to keep bhagavan inside your heart all the time you need not go to jagannath temple with train ticket sc fast class not go there take car put one to keep one luggage in a hotel or anywhere uh, go to jagannath mandir inside so many jostling you need not go. One pure beauty from here, without without closing eyes. They need not close eyes. Oh, no. Even while they are open eyes, they can see Jagannath. More clearly. How much trouble you can take to go to Puri, to Israel temple fighting, give Pranami to Panda, so many fighting. But one pure devotee, they can see Bhagavan without closing their eyes. All very clearly. Balaram, Shubhadra, Jagannath, they can see. It is a miracle. Now, in this stage, you cannot believe. I know. So, Suchi Rakinchana, so in this context, I should say that Apavitrava, Pavitrava, Sarvabhasta, Gotopiva, Jas Mareto Kundari Kaksham. So I have mantram sushi. This is the best procedure. If you can remember Jagannath, then you are always pure. Then, though purposely, Popad used, used to maintain purity, purposely, so that everybody should be alert. Okay, Madhu Goswami Maharaj. Up to Madhu Goswami Maharaj, up to Madhu Goswami Maharaj, so much purity was there. You cannot imagine. Even some devotee want to arrange Bandara. Madhu Gosima is speaking, well, I can arrange Bandara. You can bring whatever thing you like to, my devotees can cook. Maharaj never allow anybody to cook, outsider. But at present everything allowed. Paid man getting 7,000, 5,000, cooking in the temple, taking so much prasadam to home, here, there. Somehow there. At present, no. That's why as present Bandara is also Bandara, whenever you go to Bandara, you will have to think twice before going. I already gave answer in Corona Pure regarding Prasadam. So many questions came. When it can become Prasadam, when there is no problem, when problem possibility can be there of contamination, I already discovered. 
Maybe somebody became angry with me. But what to do? I learned to speak the truth. No surety. Then, how you can put guarantee? But if Bhakti Vita Madhuku Simaraj is there, a big, big exalted devotee, you will have to think who is going to who is going to arrange this bandara? First point. Oh, Madhu Gosima. Then no problem. Madhu Gosima is perfect. He can arrange perfectly. And by his devotional mood, Bhagwan is surely going to get that what is offered to Bhagwan. That is sure. But if, oh, very rich man, arrange bandara. No surety. Like in Jagannath temple, it is 100% confirmed, it is prasadam. 100% confirmed that it is prasadam, it is written in Shastra. I am not speaking. But if you are going to put one picture or you are going to make one installment of Jagannath, no surety. Bhagavan can take, cannot take, it depends upon your devotional mood. Because Bhagavan already told, Patram, Pushpam, Phalam, Toyam, Jome, Bhakta, Praja, Chati, Bhagavan already. Those who are out of their loveful mood going to offer me, that I can take. But without devotion, I cannot take. You are going to put the plate in front of Jagannath, you think Bhagavan taking. Not there. So purity means, Apavitrava, Apavitrava, Sarvavastha, Gotobiva, just mare to kundari kaksham sabajam bayam bayamantam suchi. When you are going to keep Bhagavan inside and outside, then there is no question of impurity. There is no question of impurity. So suchir akinchana mean Bhagavan is the only property in the life of devotee. The only property. No other property there. It's called akinchana. Akinjan means only support is Bhagavan and only they think Bhagavan is my property, nothing property. Like Krishna is the topmost Niskinchan. Krishna is the topmost Niskinchan. Though we know Krishna is the owner of infinity world, material world, Prakit or Prakit, or transcendental world or Prakit world, Krishna is the owner of infinity, infinity world, be it material or transcendental, it matters little. But he is the only owner. But still, Krishna is the topmost Niskinchan. Krishna is the topmost Niskinchan. Krishna speaking this point to Rukini. Krishna speaking this point to Rukini. Rukini, I am Niskinchan. And those who are Niskinchan, they love me. Usually those Niskinchan devotees, they love me. And I, I am also Niskinchan. How you are Niskinchan? How you are Niskinchan? Now I uh, give the explanation of Niskinchan mean when Bhagavan is only property in life, no other nothing is there. It's called Nikinchan. It's called ni Akinchan Niskinchan. Then how you can say you are Niskinchan? Krishna speaking, well, I am topmost Niskinchan because the lotus feet of Simati Radharani is my only property and no other property. Then, is Niskinchan number one? Even we, you, me, we cannot become Niskinchan like Krishna. That's why Aishajyasya, Samagrasya, Vidyasya, Jasya, Sasriya, Jnana, Vairagya, Shaiva, Sara, Iti, Bhaga, Ingana. It is written. Bhagavan is the topmost Vairagya detachment in the whole. Bhagavan is. So, Bhagavan is topmost Niskinchan because the lotus feet of Radharani, Simati Radharani, is the only property in the life of Krishna. Krishna don't care anyone. So, Niskinchan, naturally. So, you understand the meaning of Niskinchan? Ani ho mitabhuk. Hmm. Ani ho niri ho. Niriho, very. If anybody doing anything, but still not doing. And aniho, mitabhuk, taking prasadam, very light prasadam. 
very light prasad, but feeling energy all the time. No shortage of protein, vitamin, minerals, nothing. You give me one mineral, I give two Tarun Babu. I'm not taking. I know, I don't need. Tarun, you take. <laughs> you, know, you give mineral. <laughs> very costly mineral. What I can do? Mineral is already there in me. <laughs> Guru Dev ki. So, you see, so, Aniho Mitabhuk. Mitabhuk means a very soft prasad I'm taking. Not that can take up to this and sleep. Oh, so much prasad I'm taking and now sleep. Not that, very soft. So that no tiredness, no feeling. So all is. So they are doing any action, any of their action, whatever they are doing, they are doing in favor of bhakti. They are thinking, I am taking this, fry, and after that what will be happen? After one where I am taking so much fry, after that so much water, after I can feel some problem, so I, I cannot do Harinam, I cannot do Harikatha, so better. No, no, you take. <laughs> they are giving, distributing, they are not taking. Very controlled their life, follow. So, aniho mitubhuk shantaha, no desire for any material thing, shanta, no desire, no annavilas. Krishna bhakta nishkam atev shanta, when there is no kamana vasana, so naturally you become shanta. Shanta means tranquil, peaceful. There is no shortage of siro. Siro means he has stability of mind. Not that, now speaking, after half an hour changing. No. All is theory, very fixed up. Their plan and program all well planned and guided by Balaram. They are not going to change plan and program. So, Shanta, Sthiro, Macharano, Munihi. Macharano mean, Macharano, they are always inclined to me. They are leading their life by the shelter of my lotus feet. And Munihi, they don't like to speak any material talkings. They never indulge in all loose talkings. They never indulge in all loose talkings. Only they are speaking about Harikatha Kirtan, that's, that is quite Muni. Muni mean Mauna. Muni mean who can keep silence. Muni mean Mauna. So Muni mean, I cannot speak Harikatha, I am Mauna. It's wrong Siddhanta. I can maintain Mauna by speaking Harikatha eight hours. This is called Mauna. Because I did not speak any material talkings, I am not to. So, Apramatto. Apramatto means they are not influenced by Maya, untouched, you know, Apramatto. Apramatto means they are not Pramatto. Pramatto means Apramatto means they are always going to. Their brain well organized, apramatto, not running here and there, unstable, nothing, apramatto. They are not in confusion, never, apramatto. The reason for why Parikhit Maharaj didn't think it necessary to kill Kali, what? Because Parikhit Maharaj thought those were apramatto, they were very stable. A very fixed up. A promoto, they are not doing all wrong activities, they are not doing all sinful and nothing. Always a promoto. They are always thinking about Bhagavan, Gurudev. And according to that, all their activities are regulated. In that case, a promoto. So Parikit Maharaj thought. Parikit Maharaj, so Parikit Maharaj didn't. So Parikhit Maharaj didn't think it necessary to kill Kali. Because Parikhit Maharaj thought those who are Apramatto, very stable-minded, they are they Apramatto also means those who are thinking about only Bhagavan. They are Apramatto. More practical meaning. So anyway, what Kali can do them? Parikhit Maharaj thought, well, somebody can complain, a hey, Kali can make problem. Achha, make problem. Any anyway, Kali can make problem. Anyway, anyway, Kali can break problem. Those who are not stable-minded, those who are not doing bhajan, so what he can do? Anyway, Kali, Kali, anyway, can make problem. Anyway, Kali can make problem. But those who are apramatta, for them no problem. Those who are thinking about Bhagavan, 
is more practical according to the support according to scriptural uh, siddhanta those who are not devotee of bhagavan they have no right to take even a grass from the field it is written in sastra those who are not devotee they have no right to take in one drop from river ganga but they are taking who can speak who can check them it is written in sastra those who are not devotee they have no right to take even one drop of water from ganga not one one grass because all the property of bhagavan all are the property of bhagavan why you are going to take you have no right uh, you you can take provided you are doing bhakti and you can take as prasadam i can take one straw or one you know grass from a field as prasadam of bhagavan prasadam ha eh? as a prasadam of bhagavan i can ha eh? follow but otherwise i have no right to take ईशावश्यमिदम सर्व यत्किंचि जगत जगत तेन तक्तेन भुंजिता मा कश्य सिद्धनम इज विट इन ऑल यू कैन एक्सेप्ट एट एज अ लेफ्ट बाय भगवान एज प्रोत्साद प्योर डिबोट इज वॉट एवर दे आर वॉचिंग एनीथिंग दे एक्सेप्ट हिम बट एज अ प्रोत्साद भगवान ईशावश्यमिद सर्व यत्किंचि जगत जगत तेनो तेनो भुंजिता मा कश्य सिद्धनम इनफैक्ट द इन्फिनिटी वर्ल्ड वॉट एवर दे ऑल प्रोसादम ऑफ भगवान इनफैक्ट इन डीप कंसेप्शन सो वॉरी वरी वॉर यू से इज दैट भगवान स्पीकिंग भगवान स्पीकिंग दैट अनिहो मित भूक शांत स्थिर मच्छरण मुनि अप्रमत्व गभीर आत्मा हिज फीलिंग इज सो डीप हिज फीलिंग इज सो डीप दैट इवन ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड लीग अंडर द सी यू कैन गो इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल टू गो इफ यू गो द प्रेसर ऑफ द वाटर कैन किल एनी वे still if it is possible at all it can be possible but to estimate the heart of pure guru vishnu is impossible what is there why is speaking why thinking this way why is that is why 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 we so many question but we cannot realize apramatta gavir atma dhriti mano jit saro guna dhriti mano dhriti min All fix up is mine, Dhriti Man. Follow. So, Dhriti Man mean also patience. Like the case of, I can speak tomorrow if time. Like the case of Basudev Ji Maharaj. Basudev Ji Maharaj, all boys taken birth, taken by Kangsa and throwing, but still Basudev Ji Maharaj is keeping patience, full patience. It's called Dhriti Man. Dhriti Man has full patience there. They are never going to lose their patience. And Jito Sarogunna, they are having control over their Sarogun, Kamu, and eh, all. काम क्रोध लोभ मोह मधम आश्चर्य ऑल देर कंट्रोल जित सौर गुण अमानी दे नेवर वॉन्ट टू गेट एनी और शिप बाय एनी वर्ड दे नेवर वॉन्ट टू बी और शिप अमानी दे लाइक टू गिव ऑनर टू अदर्स अमानी माना था दे लाइक टू गिव ऑनर टू अदर्स दे डोंट लाइक टू दे आर लेस इंटरेस्ट टू टेक एनी ऑनर फ्रॉम एनी बॉडी सो अमानी मानद है न कल्प मैत्र फल सो इट इज रिटिन दैट अमानी मानद कल्प मैत्र कारुणिक कवि 
their sankalpa is fixed up, determined, and they have friendship with all jivas, karunikaha, kripalu, and karunika, this is different. After watching the painful situation, eh, follow, you can feel some pain inside her. Then you can do the action. So, more or less same, when you are watching the painful situation of somebody, then karuna can develop. Follow. I mean, after watching the painful, pain, painful situation of somebody, you develop some reaction inside your heart, that is called karuna. And after karuna, kripa I can do. Kripa means the action. After watching whatever you are doing. Follow. Follow. Karunika kavihi. Kavi mean? Kavi mean? Who they can see past, present and future. Kavi, by this word kavi, by this word kavi, it is a literal meaning in the material world. He is a writer, poet. A literal meaning. Kavi mean poet. But Kobi actually is, according to Shastra Vichar, deep meaning, who can see past, present and future, is called Kavi. Tattadarshi is Kavi. So, those all are the qualities in general. All in deep, countless quality can be discovered, like the qualities we can expect in Krishna, you see? But we are going to, Bhagavan speaking, in short. Because Vaishnavas, they are countless qualities. Those were the vital qualities, Krishna speaking, well, you can expect. After that, the second, next sloka, I can discuss and give evidence from different sastra. Today, time cannot permit. Only I can recite the sloka, which is very important. Very important. I can give evidence from Chaitanya Bhagavad, Chaitanya Charadhyaya, there are so different places I can give example. Agya vaivam gunana dosano mayadishtano pi sakano dharmano santayyaya sarvano man bhajito sa sattama He is sattama. Shat, shattaro, sattama. Positive, comparative, superative. Good, better, best. Positive, comparative, super. So, Shattamaha means Shat is good, Shattama far better than Shat, and Shattama is the highest Shat. So, why is Bhagavan, Bhagavan speaking this sloka? What is the inner meaning? That tomorrow I can discuss, today you only try to hear Agya Oivam Gunano. Dosano maya dishtano pisakano dharmano santya jiyo saravano maam bhajito sa sattamaha. So you see, this is a. So, tomorrow we can explain how we can realize this sloka. Because Bhagavan speaking, my direct order, but still they like to they like to do something else when it is possible, in which condition is what, not in general condition. General condition is not oh, what I can discuss this tomorrow anyway. Kaivalla narakaya te tidasa pura kasa puspaya te. Duddhantendriya kala sarpa patali prathkata dangstayate vidhi mahandadhishya kitayate vishampurna sukhayate yat karuna kataksha vaivavatam tam gaura mevastamahu vancha kalpaturvasya kipasindhi bhavishya patitanam pavane bhavishna bhyo namo Do kita Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. 
हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे निताय गौर हरि बोल हरि बोल हरि बो हरि बोल हरि बो हरि बोल हरि बोल निताय गौर हरि बो हरि बो हरि बो हरि हरि बो ड्यू टू शॉर्टेज ऑफ टाइम वी शुड डू एट लीस्ट हैपन आवर वन आवर डे बट टाइम इज लिमिटेड वॉट टू डू दे हैव टू गो ना